nice and sunny, clear blue skies, and uh, yeah, I'm enjoying my life right now. Today I want to talk about loneliness, and um, I just had the realization, like just now, um, I was doing some breath work and meditated after for I don't know how long, and when I opened my eyes, like just before I opened my eyes, I knew that I would be thrilled to be where I am right now. Like I knew I would be stunned by the beauty of nature. And I realized just now that it's okay to be alone so long as you have nature with you around. Like if you're in nature, it's literally like the most calming, healing thing that you could do for yourself is to just sit and look at the sky, listen to the birds, do all of that good stuff. And um, yeah, it's kind of cold and I'm wearing a tank top because, um, you know, cold exposure and all that. But it's actually quite nice sitting in the sun. It's a little bit warm. And even with the cold wind, I just feel like mother, and mother nature is blowing me a kiss. <laughs> and yeah, I was really worried about, you know, going back to Thailand and what, like, I was worried that I would lose all my discipline and kind of fall off self-improvement as it were and you know stop doing my habits because I'd have all the freedom that I want there. Oh look a pigeon. <laughs> and I realized that it's not gonna happen because I will just be in nature all the time. As it stands like I'm going to live back on my farm and you know the nature there is absolutely beautiful and I'm so excited to go back because I think for me like nothing beats being outside touching some grass sitting on the floor leaning against a comfortable tree I mean come on how good can life get and you know even though for the past few weeks the past two weeks I've kind of fallen off a little bit I've skipped meditations I've I've not like there are some things that I've been very consistent in but I've skipped like journaling a lot I've skipped doing any work and being productive and all this stuff I've definitely like fucked up my sleep schedule as well like I went to bed at like 3 a.m yesterday um, and I was just sitting in my living room not doing anything I had my phone with me and I was kind of half going on my phone looking at Pinterest and my, my socials and half kind of sitting there and staring at a wall and staring outside the window into the pitch blackness of the night and I've been doing that a lot and it's been making me just depend on vices like like smoking and drinking alcohol and it's just because when it's at that time it's like all of my deepest darkest thoughts come out and they come to haunt me like my demons come out to play as it were but it's like when i'm out here i don't feel any of that and maybe it's just because it's the morning well it's not even morning it's like one in the afternoon uh but i just woke up like two hours ago because i said i woke up i went to bed at like three and um there's a dog swimming did i show you the river maybe i can't see it can't see it I think there's a dog swimming over there, that's kind of nice. But yeah, like... Yeah, that's definitely a dog. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to go back to Thailand and I'm glad that I came out here today. I kind of forced myself out of bed and when it comes to like the cold and stuff, I've been very disciplined in that. Taking cold showers and then going out for a run and just this tank top, which is my favorite shirt. My ex bought it for me when we went on a trip in Thailand. And yeah, life is good. And you know, even though like it feels like day to day, it's a struggle. At least I can come outside and enjoy some nice weather, like, Sometimes it's hard when you've got work and then, you know, you have to like go to work and it's like, oh, like, I have to stay inside and not be kissed by the beautiful sun. Oh, I'll show you, hang on. There's a dog over there. Come on, splash, splash. Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, to be a dog swimming in the river. <laughs> this isn't even a river though, it's a, it's a pond. And uh, I don't know how clean it would be because it's not like flowing. Oh wow, he's really going for it. But yeah, I'm, um, I'm optimistic about the future. <sighs> and I've been thinking a lot about how it's almost 2024. Like how it's, you know, the, the year's just rolling by so quickly. And especially the last two weeks, I feel like they've absolutely flown by and I've just been depressed for those two weeks. And it's like, oh my God, I've been doing the wrong things all the time. And it's just like, things are, are just getting out of hand a little. And despite all that, like, everything's gonna be okay. And I think, you know, mother nature's reminding me of that and why I should believe in myself more and all this stuff. And yeah, don't be discouraged if you're struggling because at the end of the day, I think we should turn our screens off and just come outside. Even if it is cloudy or shitty weather, it's like, it's still beautiful in a sense, even when like the sun isn't out. I'm just lucky that the sun's out today and yeah, just embrace nature and keep things in your head clear. So yeah, I'll talk to you later. <laughs>